Hey, what's up, everybody? So we're gonna go into Costco and see if they are. Are they running out of stuff? Are they running out of food? Do they have any of those uh, respiratory masks? Um, I've been hearing a lot of that the uh, crapper is gonna be hitting the fan. You know, the SHTF. So we're gonna go find out. We're gonna go do some shopping, see what they have, see if they're running out of stuff, and. Um, Kind of keep it on the on the down low because Costco really doesn't like filming in there. So we're gonna go check some stuff out. We're gonna go over to the water aisle because I can't believe how much water Costco is selling. I normally stay stocked up pretty well on bottled water. Um, as you can see in my cart, um, but there's a lot of people down the water aisle. So I don't want to make it too obvious that I'm filming. I've never seen the water aisle so depleted ever since I've been shopping at Costco for the last couple of years. I had to pick an aisle where there's not a lot of people. Um, this place is crowded. But I'm noticing that the water and the toiletries, toilet paper, paper towels are going pretty quickly. Um, they got plenty of other things, but water in general, um, paper towels toilet paper those are the things that people are coming here and they're just buying them like they're not going to be able to get them plenty of rice plenty of rice rice aisle tuna fish soup Tomato products. Pasta sauce is kind of running out. They normally have this up to the top. Yeah, not much. Not much there compared to what there usually is. So people are definitely buying more food than uh, than normal. Plenty of mac and cheese. Dry pasta kind of dwindling down a little bit. Rice, short grain, brown rice, long grain. So there's definitely a lot of things that people are buying excessively. Um, water, pasta, some rice. And I'm trying to do this on the down low because Costco doesn't like filming in here we're gonna go hit the water aisle one more time it's been about 20 minutes since I went down the water aisle and I kind of want to see if how much more is gone now from when I was there the last time um, I definitely bought a lot of water, but I normally stay pretty stocked up on bottled water. 
because I very rarely drink tap water. So we're gonna go down the water aisle right now and see if, if they're out or not. For all I know is as many cases of water people were taking, they might even be out of Kirkland brand water bottles. So we're gonna go down there right now. After about 20 minutes, you're seeing how many was down here. Now they're out of Kirkland water bottles. Completely out. Sold out of water. Kirkland water. What do you guys think about that? It might be time to stock up. And paper plates are going also. Corn and green beans are almost gone. Corn and the green beans. Looks like they have plenty of other things. There's some aisles that I'm going down again because there was a lot of people in the aisles when I came down here before and didn't want to say too much. So there's the pasta sauce again. All right, so we're walking back to the car. And you know, things that I did observe is there are things that Costco is running out of. Um, I come here probably a couple times a week and they are running out of a lot of stuff that they normally are pretty well stocked in. Water, they normally have a ton of Kirkland brand water bottles. And as you see, that when we got there, when I started filming, there was probably, I don't know, I'll have to go back through the video and count, but probably 30, 40 cases of water, and then 20 minutes later or so, they were completely out of water, so people are definitely buying excessive, excessive amounts of things, uh, toiletries, water, um, pasta sauce was was a decent amount of it was bought up um, canned uh, green beans canned corn um, there was a decent amount of rice it looks like the uh, pasta dried pasta um, spaghetti noodles in that people were buying a decent amount of and uh, toilet paper paper towels and uh, definitely the water. Um, what do stores like Costco and the stores that you shop at look like? And what would you buy? Now, I did buy a few more cases of bottled water than I normally do. Normally, I'll buy two or three cases. Um, today, I bought five, five cases of bottled water. And that's kind of how food shortages start is just um, so sort of over, over by and then once people see that things are running out then other people over by um, so it might not be a bad idea to check out your local grocery store wherever you shop at and see if they are running out of stuff and probably not a bad idea to stock up even if you're not a prepper i myself am not much of a shtfer um but today i did stock up on a lot of things so let me know what you guys think in the comment section below please like comment subscribe definitely let me know what you think about um 
this video, this experience, and what you are seeing at your stores. Thanks a lot, everybody. Please like, comment, subscribe. I'll talk to everybody in my next video. Thanks a lot, everyone.